Hey everyone, we got the Chrono Cross banner today. I'm a fan of the Chrono series, but I'm not a fan of free mediocre SLB units. While they are totally usable, um, their usage, uh, it's just... It's just a typical JP formula. They are good for one dark visions, and then they'll never see play again, just like Balfir, for example. But I'll talk about this more in depth uh, in my review tomorrow. But they're better than uh, better than anticipated, or let's say in that way. The JP version was absolute trash, but Gumi did a good job. On buffing them. So what I'm actually looking for and what I really do want is the hard-hitting Sage one, 100% amplification to light. Seems good. I like it. There's a few units that I would like to put it on. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do it and once we're done, we're done. I'm not gonna go to pity. I actually just want to use my 10k lapis we got today from Vision World. That's why I'm 219k. Um, for the card, well, it's still gonna be minus 16k after all of this, but it's fine. Uh, and when we get near, which is most likely at the end of the month for Clash of Worlds, I will be up to 220k most likely. We're usually getting around 30k throughout the month, which is nice. So, without further ado, let's start. And at the end of all of this, I will also do the two weekly pulls. But first things first, 4% Neo Vision chance, 3% of those 4% or wrong, wrong counting, um, 3 fourth of all Neos, 3, of, three out of 4, that's, that's how it's supposed to be, will be on banner. So 4% Neo chance and then 3 new units are 1% each. But first pull is an entire dot, which is fine. I don't mind not getting a single one just like I did with... Uh, Lilith, um, them cool. If I don't, eh, whatever. I'm not chasing Dark Vision ranks anymore like I used to. For the most part, it's just not worth it. Especially the uh, energy usage and the hassle with uh, variance farming in particular. Oh, there's our first Neo. So, 3 out of 4 chance. Lynx. If I want one, it's actually either links or search links for the STMR for actual damage DPS, which is the same thing. I just realized it. Surge is the best DPS out of the three, technically speaking, because he's light, and light is a good element. Whereas dark, which is links's element, is not. So get that we got one of the new units, which technically speaking is EX plus two right away if I choose to get uh, his shards. Another dot pull, whatever. I hate these symbol pulls, by the way. All right, let's uh, check the 94% off banner. Guaranteed no. And it's... Fryevia, already EX plus 3. But man, the on or the general Neo Vision rate is really bad this time around, especially for a 4% one. I had way more Neos last week on the Lilith banner with 3% chance. Alright, two more pulls and then we're done for today with the lab. Another guaranteed off banner. Almost guaranteed. Ihana, that's a really good off banner to get. I am not disappointed at all. Her TMR is awesome. So that's a really good one. I like it. Only for the TMR though. But man, zero Neos outside, or only one Neo outside of the it, the, the guaranteed ones, which is 10, 11, no, 11, 22, 30, 44, 55, 66 uh, pulls in total, and only one Neo at a 4% chance is really bad pulls. Like, that's far below average. I should have got at least two. 
But oh well. Like I mentioned, don't really care. Another Esther. Halfway through, I believe, to third ES plus three, so that pull basically. And that's pretty much it. Only one Neo. Or nope, two Neos. So let's see, search, please. Another Lynx, can't be too mad, it's it's a nice one for the STMRs. So I got two Lynx STMRs, which is cool. I don't mind, that's fine. But it doesn't end up there. We do have two more um, weekly pulls. So let's do the Chrono Cross 310 plus one weekly summon. Probably mostly blues and yellows. Here it comes. What's in the box? Just like expected. Blues and yellows and one guaranteed rainbow apparently. So pretty much trash. And let's get our guaranteed off banner trashy Neo unless it's from the last five or six weeks. Which it probably isn't. And we get... Oh! Ultimate Regina, bad unit, but I have her for the collection. And the STMR, which is technically speaking, her STMR is good on um, what's his name? Golbess. So that's fine. I like it for the STMR. Very cool. It's a new unit, as you can see for me. So perfect. I like it. I do not mind new units. And yeah, that's pretty much it for today. Thank you all for watching. That's the end of the poll video. <laughs> and we'll see each other tomorrow for the review, I guess. Unless there's any tough challenge on the Chrono stuff, but I don't think there is. So at the very latest, see you tomorrow for the review. Bye-bye.